Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Credit Quest. Today, we're going to be playing as Lucy Loud. Uh, I have no idea what she does. <laughs> so, we're gonna figure this all out together. Yeah! So, we're starting with Invader Zim. Interesting. Lucy Loud versus Zim. Yeah, I, I, I've only barely... I, I've only watched, like, maybe an episode, like, half an episode of Loud House. So, I've got no idea what's going on with this chick. She She's obsessed with, obsessed with dead thing. Failure. It's all your fault. The streak of bad luck. No escape from the cycle in which you are stuck. I am Zim! Sure. I was just trying to play on medium because I think medium is more fair. And really, all 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 it changes is um all it really changes is uh the life count. Anyhow, and maybe maybe they are uh, more aggressive. Oh, does Zim have like a counter attack or something? Coffin the slam. Shit. <laughs> what? Hitbox! How's that safe? Alright. Zim dead. Zim go boom. Ow, stop that. Sir? Sir? Okay. Sir? What's the flying dust ring doing? Oh. What's her time? <laughs> she has no time. Is there like a just defense system in this game or something? special moves in this game. Ah! There we go. That stings. Sure, sure it does. All right. Any day now. I wish all the- I- I mean, I think there's enough characters. If it's always seven stages, then all you do is need to load 14. So, yeah. I don't think we saw Danny Phantom in the last episode, so let's choose Danny Phantom. Lucy Loud versus Danny Phantom. I had to tell you about the stream I had last night. The only thing that has an expiration date here is you! <laughs> Ready? Yeah, because everything dies. One. This match is full of dead people. Alright, Danny! Danny! Oh my god, Danny, please! Fuck out of here! 
you, good sir! Ha! Well, I just got cheated hardcore. And that's there. That. <laughs> and that's that! Somehow, I don't think it is. Yeah. So, I don't know. I mean, part of... I feel like in this game, like, I'm not using specials as much as I usually would in Smash Bros. Maybe because there's two different other attack buttons I can use that are often safer. I guess maybe I did hit the special button by accident. But then again, there's no side specials. It's only neutral. Yeah. I have to tell. Okay. I'll move like this and and this. I think I've got it. Sure, Nigel. Whatever you say. All right, so your lives do get replenished every match. So. It's not nearly as difficult as Smash Bros. So, literally the only incentive that you have to not die is to not lose lives. <laughs> okay, I guess it's fitting that just as Lucy I keep killing myself. Or maybe that wasn't even an SD. So I have this bite thing, oh, which is just... I guess, do I get like a buff from it or something? Oh, it builds into something. Okay. And then I have the bat thing. And then, oh, I must have done down special, because it's like a forward rushing teleport or something. That would explain it. That, that would definitely explain it. I hate that stage. That stage is really fucking annoying. Because... It, you're you're just been trying to you're just trying to say it's like a slightly less annoying version of Big Blue. That's kind of what it's like. Uh, I already fought Toph last episode, so let's fight Powder Toast Man. Powder Toast Man. Nice. Uh, but yeah, I think Lucy's okay. I think I think I liked SpongeBob a little bit more, only because his moves felt more like. Standardized, but Lucy isn't bad. Uh, blah 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 blah. Jiminy! <laughs> Whatever that means. I don't, I don't. I don't. I don't. I've not. I've only seen bits and pieces of Ren and Stimpy. I don't know what the fuck is going on. I don't know what. And I don't think. I don't, I don't see. I have never seen Powdered Toast Man in that show. So. Like, I've only seen GIFs. <laughs> That's all I've seen of this, this doofus. So, I have no goddamn idea what the fuck is going on. Oh my god, just stay down, you I'm already dead?! Oh shit. Okay, so either... Okay, well I mean, I've heard, I've heard some people compare Powder Toast Man to Captain Falcon. So, maybe he's just like really strong, but... His moves are like short ranged and not all all too safe. And I think Lucy might be a, like a like a lightweight kind of character because she's because she dies way faster than SpongeBob does. I actually lose the Powder Toast Man. Well, it's because he keeps fucking running away every time I try to hit him with anything, and the stage doesn't help. Oh my god, just die! Just fucking die! I didn't want him to die that way! But fine, he died. Shit. Alright. Doink, doink. No, why? I don't want to come. 
chomp. Oh my god, oh my god, how did I tech that? How the fuck did I tech that? Ah, fuck. Whatever, at least I got half a little. Pause. <laughs> Dead! <laughs> what the hell, man? What are you doing? Oh my god, please let me grab you. He's just fidgeting on the ledge. Shit. Okay, I, I cannot go on these upper platforms because the blast is the blast zone is way too close. Coffin! Oh my god, why does he do this? Oh, okay. All right. Oh! He killed himself again. I'm toasting off again. Pfft. Stupid. Anyhow, uh, Oblina, we fought her last episode. Except it's on a stage that's not nearly as annoying. So that's good. <laughs> It's just on battlefield, pretty much. This stage, this stage you're going to, like, it's one of the space levels, not the stupid one for Ren and Stimpy. But just like, I think it's a Zim stage. Is this for Invader Zim? Ah, uh, the futility of life. To the nice. I hope this game does well to where they get voice acting, because I mean, that would help give it a little more charm. I didn't realize how small Oblina was. This ca that counted? Shit. Oh, oh. Alright. Alright, so you get the bite, and then... And then depending on how many bites you get, you get, like, different effects over time. We're gonna have to land a second one. Mm -hmm. But yeah, this this thing is basically battlefield, which is good. Oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> ah, okay. That's how I get the bats. This game didn't jump the. Sh okay. Alright, I get it. So, if I get a bite off, I can use shield to, to get the bats out. Alright, I'm getting this character. I'm getting this character. And then you get a second bite, and then you get invisibility. Oh, shit! That, that's, a, that's a true combo? No. no. Oh shit. Yeah, Lucy doesn't have as much like na as many natural lingers as SpongeBob did. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, it's over for you, Oblina. Can you okay, it's the stages that are fucking me up. It's the weirder stages that screw me up. Because there's like a mix. There's a mix of like weird stages plus other ones. Alright, um. I'd rather fight Leonardo, to be honest. I mean, who am I fighting next? I don't. I don't know who I'm gonna be fighting last. But, uh, I'll fight Leonardo. Just because I really don't care at all about Korra. <laughs> I don't care at all about Korra! Shit! Yeah. <laughs> uh, we turtles don't know the meaning of the word defeat. Alright, Leo, two, whatever you say. I, I didn't even. Did I, I think I fought Michelangelo. Did I fight Michelangelo in the last one? I don't know. Whatever the case, Leonardo is fucking me up. 
go. I'll, I'm pretty sure that tournament, that sword spin attack, is in one of the uh, Team and T tournament fighter games. Oh, are you fucking serious? Just random gravestones pop up? That is so stupid. What a way to ruin a perfectly balanced stage. I mean, it's pretty small, though, to be brutally honest. It's like that one Soul Calibur stage, where it's like, you do anything and it makes a ring out happen. And then they had to patch it, just because everyone kept getting ring outs. Oh, what a hit. Bonk. Right. I wanted to dash dance, you fuck! Leonardo. No. I don't know how I teched on that grave, but I did. Baby, I compare you to a kiss from a tech on the grave. On the grave. Oh! Fuck out of here, Leo. Slap the shit out of them with these fucking, like, what, tarot cards? I think they're tarot cards. Ah! Oh, shit! <laughs> yeah, if none of the gravestones popping up, this would be a fair stage. Ah! I almost fucking... Mm. Oh shit! Oh, I thought that other thing was a wall! I didn't realize it wasn't a wall. This is weird. It's not like the other... Like, the Avatar stage that's also kind of an FD sort of layout. Like, that, that I'm pretty sure has solid walls on its bottoms. So, I, I don't know. But, uh, look at that! It's interesting. Alright, Helga! We were, I had a feeling we were gonna fight Helga. <laughs> I had a feeling that we were gonna fight Helga, so... We, we are! <laughs> we're fighting Helga now! Surprise, we're fighting Helga now! <laughs> Ready? Totally not! Three, two, one, go. Anyway, I don't know if I fought on the Glove World stage. Dude, I love the fact they fucking threw the fiery fist of pain on this stage. Like, like it's already cool enough that they have a Glove World stage, let alone the fact that the fucking fiery fist of pain is on it. Also, Helga does not know what to do on this stage. She doesn't. Okay, never mind. Maybe she does. <laughs> Maybe she does know what to do. Leave me alone! Oh, fu- Okay, alright. That's, um, that's good. Is it like a modifier for how their moves? Oh my god, how am I not dead? Have I, oh my god, have I been, did I DI it the other times or not? I don't think I did. Oh my god! <laughs> the platforms on this stage just let you do the nastiest shit. <laughs> oh my god. There we go. We did it. And she smiled for a bat. Cool. And I got a gold medal. Well, look at that. So, anyhow. That's gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Credit Quest on 
the next episode, we are going to be playing as... Cat Dog! You can see where I'm going with this. So that's the only really, like... The only series I get a bunch of characters back-to-back, -back or, like... I'll have to do Patrick and Sandy back-to-back, -back, and then Aang and Toph back-to-back. But other than that, we'll be shuffling the series the entire time. So, yeah. Anyhow, uh, next episode we're going to be playing as Cat Dog. <laughs> With that said and done, I've been Reaper Vegas, and I'll see you all next time.